Hi, my name is Gino Donovan. I'm the registrar here at the Crawford. I just want to speak to you a little bit about one of the objects from our exhibition, Citizen Nowhere, Citizen Somewhere, which is a doll which belonged to Terence McSweeney's daughter, Moira McSweeney Brewer. The Catalonian doll was cleaned and restored as part of a joint collaboration between Cork Public Museum and the Crawford Art Gallery to prepare her for the exhibition. She's over 100 years old and what we found so fascinating is the level of detail that has gone into her creation um, in terms of textiles and the actual make of the doll itself. So it is real human hair on her head. The outfit is typical Catalonian of the early um, 20th century and the lace mantilla and tatting on the collar of her dress, her gloves and her stockings would have all been done by hand and the craftsmanship of the stitching is absolutely amazing to see. Quite a lot of the material on the lace mantilla had just disintegrated over time, being a natural fibre. So all of this was um, webbed back together and restitched to preserve it even further. Um, she was cleaned. You can see her shoes here are black patent leather and they actually bear the stamp of a shoemaker's shop in Barcelona. The skirt is silk, which has been interwoven with metallic fibres that are genuine metal that have been polished, which has returned its sheen to it. And her undergarments are made of the finest linen. And all of this tatting on the edges would have again been done by hand. And just the level of detail is spectacular. What's also really interesting is the combination of materials used in making the actual doll herself. So her face is porcelain that's been hand painted and her body is wooden with elastic that would have run all up the core uh, holding her arms and legs together which are all movable. And her hands are a very early form of plastic and plastic at that time would not have been widely used in the construction of toys and was very limited in, in the colours that you could you could get and so on so it, it's just fascinating to see those three different media used in in the body of the doll herself.